That was a crazy setup. Three episodes, and it was all prologue. Never did I think that they would just end the main character immediately until it was being positioned of like, oh no, Raphael is actually going to, you know, deny the, uh, like the appeal. He's going to say the truth out loud. He's basically saying the one piece is real. And everyone's like, whoa, the idea moves forward. Even if one man dies, right? You can't kill the man. The idea will then be inherited by someone else. The will, right? It's getting so hyped. The setup was amazing. And now what? We've had a time skip. There's a guy that's like leading another dude, right? It's like a hostage to open up the safe. Now, we did burn a bunch of shit, but then we put it out. There was also a reward that was supposed to be given for people that's burnt all the stuff that Schubert said to do, but I don't remember that shit actually happening. What else is left? And then there was a letter. The letter called earth that rafael wrote and now we're about to figure out maybe more secrets of heliocentrism let's begin today's reaction oh the reward was the poison i didn't realize the necklace was the reward i thought it was some that was just given to him i thought the reward was specifically from the chest after you burned it because hubert gave the necklace to him directly but the poppy stuff was in there yeah who's the main character now is that you Oh, I, I was like, they're, they're giving them food. I thought this is their bathroom sewage system where they throw shit out and the peasants are being shit on right now, but no. There's like these nobles and these, you know, people just throwing pig slop and the people, like, yes, give us more food. Evil. Evil. Oh shit, we're going back to the theme of beauty. The world is beautiful. Bald. What? Oh, right. It's their geocentrism theory. Cap. And the more that the church can like make you think that you're all sinners, you're all corrupt, you need the church's help, or else you're ever you're forever going to just like, you know, suffer in hell. It's in their best interest. Everything about geocentrism is made such that the people are helpless without the church's intervention and you must praise and you know you need to fucking uh, repent for your sins mm, good question mm, very good question bro none of this is fucking science you're literally just making fantasy lore right now headcanon creepy vision though New names. It's so beautiful. You got good eyes like Raphael? Transferred. Are they hinting that he's already recanted once or no? I don't know. He doesn't look at them anymore. Is it simply because of what the church told him or did he fuck up once and he's already one out of two? <laughs> the gift mask on. What are we doing with this shit? Are they gonna rob people? That's hilarious. They can't show Raphael in the opening anymore. So they switched it with this guy. show him here oh no it would be so funny if the opening was now just all like oxy just like everything rafael it's basically just oxy instead even at the school yes even at school this is oxy's father they should have just done the card commit the fact that this world is far more beautiful than heaven itself hmm. but the world is supposed to be a disgusting place full of sinners uh oh what are these thugs what doing with their masks? Are they here to rob people? What are they doing? No, no, no. Civilian watch. What? What? 
ましょうかはあ<笑>決闘開始 You just duel people in public? Well, the peasants are fucking cooking your ass. But he was supposed to duel someone else, and we show up and you just start dueling while hiding our identity? Okay, it's, it's the culture in this town, right? I'm trying to understand. Coward. I wonder if that's a lie. Yeah. <laughs> Why'd you challenge? Because he knew that he would win. Motherfucker, you challenging, you're about to take a life when you're not prepared to die yourself, you coward. Disarm! That blade has jagged edges to just like contain that sword. Bam, the animation there was so good. Okay. Yeah, are we just here to farm this guy? Just to get a bunch of money? Or are we here to make a point? What if I do? But I have to? Did it go in? Yeah, it did! Fast stab! Okay! A good fighter. Burn in hell? This is where you go over to him and whisper in his ears. Heaven and hell doesn't exist. You will now turn into nothingness forever. You do not matter. Give him, like, just break his fucking worldview. Just, like, just give him a fucking panic attack before he died. That'd be the most, like, cruel monster thing to do. Do we get paid nicely for this? We're just like mercenaries. Contemplating. Probably not. He's probably a shitter himself. If heaven exists. Who would ever die in satisfaction? And that's another thing, right? If everyone is so convinced that they have eternal happiness and blessing when they die and go to heaven. Why does everyone just like shit their pants? That's a, <laughs> that's something that cheeky me did. Yeah, Raphael, because he's of D clan. You know, only the people of the D clan die smiling and laugh. But um, something really fucked up that I did once, because I was a stupid edgy kid back in like high school. I think like it was like grade eight or nine. I think I I challenged the pastor at our fucking local church of like, all right. You guys all think you're gonna go to heaven. Why doesn't anyone just die or kill yourselves? Well, I think suicide is like one thing that disallows you from going to heaven. But it's like, okay, to have the other guy kill the other dude. It's just like, of course not. That's fucking crazy. Everyone is scared. When you're facing death, right? That's when your true personality shows up. Better be a good boy then if you want to be on the good list. <laughs> The beautiful sky? You can't like anything? Yeah, that's the thing. Our main character is kind of naive, huh? This new guy, Oxy, is a really good fighter because of his like reflexes or reactions, right? His eyes. Very, very strong fighter. But like, he's pretty naive and feels guilty. Am I gonna go to hell? Does heaven exist? And he just gets told some nice words and suddenly he's all good. He's a very simple man. Is this all an act? He's like a very humble, simple man. Oh, he knows the truth. Damn! He fucking tell- he's just, he's just saying this shit that no one else will say. It's a very doomer, nihilistic- He actually wants to die. I don't know if he wants to die, but like, to him, this world is a nasty place. If you don't win the lotto, you were just gonna suffer. So you know what? 
the only safe, the, the only like grace that I have is just go to heaven. So would he be fine with just dying now then? This guy's crazy. <laughs> He's a doomer. Very eccentric guy. What? How do he find hope? Did he find God in a symbolic way? Maybe he got a wife or a girlfriend. They know we're assassins, huh? Damn, duelists are not respected because only nobles are allowed. I thought that if you're like a warrior, like a strong fighter, you'd have some clout here, but no. They're already like showing us this like new setting. I don't know if we're still in Poland or not, but like we already saw like the beginning section where like people just throwing fucking like pig scraps, right? And the peasants are like catching it, right? So you can see the huge gap in the classes. <laughs> Now they're gonna think we're fucking crazy. But we are. I think we are. Well, he probably isn't. But like, Okze, something is loose in his head. He's, he's kind of funny. But it's, there's something off with his head. I don't think he's forgiving you, bro. I think this is like... Him not wanting to make eye contact or pull aggro from like a hostile NPC on the streets. Like, you're like a crazy homeless person. He's like, no, I don't want to do anything with you. Go away. Oh, right, what are we talking about? The hope. Yeah. What's the proof, bro? It's a gospel. Mars? Different planet. The sun rises from the east. Yeah. That's crazy. These dudes don't have telescopes. They don't have anything. They literally just look at the star. They're like, Is it moving? Is it moving? And they do this for multiple days. They're like, did it move? Oh shit, it fucking moved. Maybe it's their delusions in their head, but this is crazy. The early game of constellations and observing, like observing the star. Five planets exist, guys. Wow. Mars. Bro discovered Mars. What is it orbiting around? Hmm? What is it orbiting around? Because if Earth is the center of the universe, it should be orbiting around Earth, right? Is this now then going to somehow contradict, you know, geocentralism? Like, what, what are we going to do this? Very hopeful. Okay. Wow. Amazing. I mean, if it works for you, I guess it works for you. But like... I don't think Okse understood anything. And he's like, what? What are you talking? Mars? Okay. You see it? It gives you hope? It doesn't give me hope. The grand finale. Wow. I don't think he's really into it. Read my mind. It's a noble again. That's just so crazy to me that back in the day, you could just go out to a bar and just call people peasants and they would do nothing back. Because they can't, because that's the fucking class structure that exists. That is like, that, that's mind blowing. And it's just the like norm here. <laughs> you ignorant peasants, it's like my bad for being peasants. <laughs> 
いやいやじゃせいぜい楽しんでくれよ。OK。しかし、観測をはじ。Why? じゃなきゃ、もっと。Noticed what? <笑>適当なこと。Noticed what? I don't know! It's a bad timing! The full circle cannot be done. That's what's gonna happen. どうしましたそんなバカな。毎日。毎日。But no more! それがこっついぶん遅くなっていたんだが、今日。Stop! 火星が止まった。I don't know. Fucking.、Uh, this has to contradict the geocentrism model. I don't know. Ask the church this. Tell them about Mars. What's going on? We probably die, though. For two fucking years, he was just staring at something in the sky. Just. Oh, it's gonna happen. Two years? It gives me hope. Everything that I believe my world values is just on Mars making a full lap, and now. <laughs> nope. Not happening. Bro's gonna lose all fucking hope of life now. What do you think, Oxe? What does your eye see, bro? What does your eye see? Oh. Damn, look at that fluid animation in the background scene. I think that grass is like more normal than us. I think we're the weirdos. Oh. Another duel done. Ooh. <laughs> His entire family died to a plague. He lost all hope. He's suicidal. And then what did he do? Mars! I found new hope. There's a reason to live. <laughs> I think we should go do a wellness check on grass right now. So much damage. Damn. So you get punished for suicide, right? Because again, suicide is like really, really bad. And they. <laughs> what are they gonna do? Kill me? Okay, I'm gonna try to commit a game. Are you gonna punish me until I die? What? Yeah, Mars. Got a little loco. That's crazy that he's the unpredictable one. He seemed to be a reasonable person until now. Are you there? Grass? You good? He's not good. It bent? The circle? Line? It's going back! You got uh, I don't have enough knowledge about fucking planets and fucking constellations, bro. I watch fucking anime for a living. But this has to do with the orbiting, the whole, like, contradiction with geocentrism, the way that we also revolve around the sun, Mars revolves around the sun. Like, it's gotta be something to do with that shit, right? You got the... Something, something retrograde motion. Go Google that shit for more... In-depth explanation of why this is happening. どうも。ああ、じゃあ行こうか。今日は観測なしですか。君の言う通り、天国を差し置いてこの世界間違っていたのかもと思う。Oh, Another Inquisitor! But he bawled. That's like minus couple aura. Novak wasn't bald, but he wasn't part of like the actual church, right? He was like an ex-mercenary hired by the bishop, but I wonder if Novak's gonna matter anymore or if he's just done. Who that? Yo, he smiled at us. Is this Novak? New hairstyle? <gasps> New hairstyle? Leo, he looks way better like this. I wasn't really a fan of like the long, you know, hair like that. The beard and like the two part, that's a great look. <laughs> First thing he does come back just shows up fucking asleep. It's like blood stain. Why not? This is a Huber 2.0. Yeah, I want to know why Mars is going back, man. Can you tell us? 
あなたと話してはいけない決まりにな。Yeah, we're talking! <laughs> yes. <laughs> Dude, the, the shit that Oxy just says is so funny to me. He just says what's on his mind, regardless of the fucking mood. I don't know, it's just hilarious. I pity you, bro. I pity you. And that's why I feel bad. But I won't. Okay, I'm not gonna hit you. I'm not gonna hit you, pal. Okay, Oxy. Because I want the truth. Nope. Nope. なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。なるほど。
Yeah, rather than, I don't know, some people think like rather than hell, like the world that we live in is hell, but rather than hoping for heaven, why not realize that perhaps the world you're living in is beautiful already? Hmm? Oh, this must be how we see that 10 year time skip and they're climbing the mountain to open that box, right? That's what he must be alluding to. Earth letter. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Will you take it? For me, I feel like I would have to just know the truth. For me, it's just like, I would always live with this thought of like, what if that regret? What if the truth was there and I never fucking knew it, right? I could not live with that, even if it meant my death. So if I was in their positions, I'd go for it. I don't know if grass thinks like that, though. Dosuru. Freedom. <laughs> Baited. Let's go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hmm? Please? Why did he point it at us? To go? And that's another episode of Orb and... We got a new main character. Even the opening <laughs> shows... You know, instead of Rafael Oxy. And Oxy, what kind of person is he? He's got great eyes, great fighter. Killed a lot of people. They're like duelists. They take on like mercenary jobs. That's how they go on living. We're peasants here. We're part of a guild. And you know, there's a lot of nobles here. Now, he is afraid, right? It seems like back in the day... I'm not sure if he has strike one, but the flashback scene of like the church person kind of teaching him about how Earth is at the very bottom and how he said, I don't look at the sky anymore. Did he recant once already or is that something else to do with it? He yearns to know what's real. He wants to know and his friend Grass, his entire family died and then he found Mars as a new project that gave him hope. But you know, now he's all suicidal now because he realizes that, you know, it's not making a full lap. But Retrograde action, something about Earth being inner, moving faster. This explains how Mars seems to have stopped and go back. No, everything is working. It's just contradicting the geocentrism that they're thinking about. And with the limited technology, of course, that's going to be the conclusion that we arrive to. And this mysterious guy, who knows exactly how, you know, he knows about Raphael's secret stash, but, you know, we'd have to have a backstory for him. And I'm sure some mysterious other hooded figure told him about that. And now they're being confronted about the truth of the world. Heaven exists as a comforting lie for you to just live in this quote-unquote shitty world, but don't you want to believe that the world is beautiful too? The theme of world being beautiful is just like a reiterating theme, and both of them, I think, are going to go find the box, and that's it for me. If you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content, and until next time, take care.